618. I got up at 130. Oh, I edited some videos. I then went to bed at three. I then got up at five. It's a working vacation now. So two years ago, I watched sunrise from a rock. There's a cave in this gigantic rock. I climbed up there, spectacular sunrise. Well, when I watched it, I realized there's a cave above the cave. So this time I'm climbing higher. I'm climbing higher. Yeah. the drone twice I've never crashed this drone but as it, as it gets close over here it's like magnetically getting sucked into the rock <laughs> vacuums and vortexes of wind that I don't understand I know on the first one I'm lucky that it flew it again this second one was so bad I'm surprised I got it back it hit up here and fell in crevices so I haven't even tried to start it yet. I know. You know I'm already down. I'm already down a camera. That's the price. I know that's the price I pay for this because I'm bringing electronics into an environment but that they don't exist. And eventually the environment will win. The environment wins. But here's what I'm gonna do. Think about launching the drone to see if it works. Oh, it has battle wounds. Don't we all? No, I don't feel defeated. Nobody has fought more for all of this than me. You know? Okay. Again, I couldn't control it now, which who knows? It just was descending. Well, thank God it's descended pretty close. Okay, I got it back. <sighs> Listen, there's a lot of thank gods. And that's all of that is sucky. There's a lot of thank gods. Thank God when it hit the rock, it, I was able to get it. Thank God when it went into the ocean, it was right there. Um, this sucks. I need to regroup and um, gonna figure things out. Wow, like a fish, it tried to jump back out of the water. <laughs> Shut up. Oh my god, I'm going back to Zakynthos again with no drone? Don't say that. Don't say that. Okay, come on, you. I'm gonna go take care of you. It's just electronics.
and salt water. You know what? I'm gonna make a decision right now. It seems dramatic, but it really isn't. It's it's actually rational, practical thinking, which I'm very good at that. Do you know that I have a week more of my vacation left? I'm going to Zakynthos. I, mean, I have a, a week to go. And I have made the decision that the show, get ready, is over. Yeah, it's over. Number one, it's been done. Number two, the cost now is, it's ridiculous. Well, that back there, although not really discouraging and not defeating, it was just a, a bright blinking beacon to say, you're done, you're done. On this trip, this isn't working. The sound is horrible. The, the good camera is broken. The drone went into the water. There's not much left to do this on. The show's over. Will I change my mind? That's possible. I've mentally sobered up. So here's what happened. I have Ziploc bags. I've got rice. I've got toothpaste. So I believe I'm giving up on flying it at all. I'm just minimizing the best as I can for repair, right? Anyway, let's, let's do that. Let's take care of it. I'm gonna rinse it in water. So what happened? Well, not, I mean, not the obvious. Not the obvious. So what happened? You know, what didn't happen? And that was, I said, there was a different cave up on the top and I was going to go check that out. So inevitably, what didn't happen is I didn't go to the cave. I didn't climb. Right? And then you say, well, why didn't I climb? Well, something prevented me from climbing. The drone. The drone crashed two times into the rocks. And, uh, you know, I do know how to pilot these things. There was wind vortexes that were throwing into the rocks. And then when the coast is clear, it went and landed in the water when I didn't land it in the water. The drone prevented me from going to climb, which I was going to climb higher. And you know, listen, number one, this is a very holy island, and I have always had angels and guardians looking out after me. So when you realize this drone kept me from doing something, this is actually a good story. So for to me say, I'm shutting down the vlog, and I'm so tired of disappointment, you're not understanding what gift I possibly received. Because even the gift allowed me to have it. I have it. It can be repaired. How fast can you change your perspective and sometimes think not exactly what happened to you, but quite possibly what didn't happen to you. These events might have actually been the greatest gift I possibly could receive.